Left coast is the best coast. All right, let's get into this. Badass. I'm super excited to receive this Darth Vader from the fine folks at Gentle Giant and Diamond Select. I had the pleasure of working on both the figure concept as well as the card back design and layout for the front and back. As you will see, uh, there's a little special feature in this Return of the Jedi version of Darth Vader. One of the cooler things about the Jumbo figures by Jumbo Giant is the resealable, collector-friendly clam shell packaging. I wish more action figure companies would, would make packaging that is collector-friendly. we have Lack Sivrak's favorite part of action figure collecting. It's the zap straps inside of the clamshells. It is a little overdue, but you know, if it helps prevent the toys from breaking and during transit, then I guess that's cool. But it is a bit of a pain in the ass sometimes. They're held in there pretty good. And it wouldn't be a Kenner Darth Vader action figure without a telescoping red lightsaber. In that vintage Kenner style we all know. We have a look at that. It is just a single telescoping saber. I don't think they've yet done a double telescoping lightsaber for anyone. I could be wrong, but it's a good idea for an exclusive. Yeah, this guy's awesome. Just like uh, just like when we were kids, but with one small difference. Cape's a little wrinkled, but that's okay. It can be flattened out. Chest details, the familiar five points of articulation, Just and behold! Let me look on you with my own It's a removable eyes. helmet, Canner Darth Vader actually. How badass is that? Fantastic work. Super thrilled with this project, and I'm, I'm glad he finally arrived. 
and I can show them off. Thanks for watching, and then let me reveal this Darth Vader action figure to you. He's still available now from General Giant's website. I believe he's $80 US. And uh, collect them all and let them Just breathe. For once, let me look on you with my own eyes. Left coat.